very curious place today. We are going to be looking at this oil lamp. Now this oil lamp, which is from Fluorescence, um, yeah, Fluorescence, this is a Walmart product. <clears throat> now, I know probably some people are like, why do you have an oil lamp? There's a very good reason. Everybody remembers the storm of last winter. If you don't, <laughs> my, you're lucky. Okay, now, I live in South Texas. I do not live in North Texas. Let me get that up there. In North Texas, people are a bit more set up to deal with the cold. South Texas, not so much. So, one thing, we did not have electricity. We did not have heat. We did not have lights. So, um, yeah. So, this was one of the things I wanted to make sure I got was something to where I have light. Now, not only does this put out light, but it also puts out heat. Okay? So, I got this just to see. This um, is $13 and some change at Walmart. They have another kind, which I'm going to get to review too. That one is more of a lantern style, has a handle. This is more of a, it's pretty, it looks good sitting on a table type. And, of course, where is it? Oh, there it is. Boom! Lamp oil. Now, the lamp oil is $7.88, and this is for 64 fluid ounces. Okay? So, here's what we're going to do. We're going to fill this up, and we're going to test it. And I can tell you right now that I was a bit concerned because I, it felt really light, but this doesn't feel that, that thin. Um, don't get me wrong, it's not the heavy, heavy duty-est, heavy duty -est. it's not the he heaviest, but um, you're still going to be need to be careful with it. It's glass, okay? Um, but, but it's better than I thought. Um, okay, we've also got this. Why did I... I don't know what I'm doing. So I, I apparently unscrewed the top from this and then I have no idea what I'm doing. Did I say that already? In case I didn't. Okay, now for this, I only have a limited amount of cord. Cord, wick. Um, I have a limited amount of wick that comes with this. So that is one of the things you need to have extra wick because this is a very short amount of wick. So I am going to need to buy more of that. But just to start out, we're doing okay. Except for the fact that now my finger's dirty. Um, and of course I don't have a paper towel. Yeah, wipe it on that. Alright, so here's, let's see if we can pour it in without making a mess. Which would be the, <laughs> the goal. That's the goal. That is definitely the goal. Mm -hmm. do, 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 do. I'm spilling. Okay. I'm not gonna fill it up all the way because I'm already spilling. So we're gonna we're gonna leave it like that. And I'm gonna put this down here. Okay. So I didn't do too bad. I. I did a little bit. <laughs> Just a little teeny bit. I am going to need to clean that. <laughs> but when I came outside to do this, I brought wet wipes. So, there you go. Um, I'm going to clean up my hands and the table. So, yeah. This is flammable. Just FYI. Um, so, make sure that's on good. And now we get to put the wick and everything on, and we'll screw this back on. Why I had to take everything apart, I don't know. It's just, it apparently is what it is. Now, Would it have been easier if I hadn't taken it all apart? Yes, it would have, but since when have I ever done anything easy? Let me help you. Never. I've never done anything that's... Yeah. I think it's on. I 
Okay. There. All right. Now I do have lighters. Let's try not to... The goal here is to not set myself on fire. Say a little prayer. Okay, now we take this off. Oh, and look, there's a piece of paper on that. Yeah, that would be bad to leave on. Okay, so we're going to try and... Apparently, okay. so the goal is to light this without setting myself on fire. <laughs> uh, is there a trick to this? Okay, remove gust to screw burner from layout cell base and place burner in it. Insert with killing titan burner to allow it to set. Okay, apparently you have to let this soak for 15 minutes. Always read the directions before you do anything. Always read the directions. So I'll be back in... I'll be back in 15 minutes. Hello and welcome to A Very Curious Place and we're back! Now, it hasn't been exactly 15 minutes. But I did put the fire out. Um, so we're gonna try again. Please don't set yourself on fire. Please don't set yourself on fire. <gasps> fire! And look, it's not on me, it's just on the wick. Awesome! Wow, that is a big fucking flame. Um, okay, maybe we'll maybe we'll move the wick down a little bit. Oh, that didn't help. Oh, okay. Is this supposed to be that big of a flame? I don't. Um, okay. Maybe take the flammable thing out of my hand and uh, move it away from the flame. Um, is the flame supposed to be that big? I've, I've never used an oil lamp before. Oh God, I'm gonna set myself on fire if I'm not careful. Okay, here's here's the. I'm gonna try and do this. Um, there's there's a mess over here. Just ignore it. Um, so we're gonna. Oh, don't set yourself on fire. Whoa. Okay. Wow. Okay, that does not look like it should. Okay. That's better. Okay. Huh, look at that. It goes down smaller. Oh, I should probably move you, shouldn't I? Okay. All right. So apparently, if you move the wick down lower, um, it gets smaller. And if you move the wick up higher, it it gets big. Wow. Um, okay. Um, we'll stay with that. That looks safe. Huh. Two thumbs up. I'm a little afraid of it, if I'm honest. I'm sure it'll be fine. Um, I will say this, when you, when you, when you put, it puts out a lot of heat. And a lot of smoke. Is that normal? Oh, but, but hey, the reason I bought it was because it puts out heat. Yay. And it also puts out light. And I'm sure I'll get better at using it, and so that I don't have to worry about setting myself aflame. Two, th two thumbs up. Um, on a scale of one to five, I mean, it's not the most heavy duty of lamps. Um, I, I feel that this is something that if you dropped it, even from a short distance, which we're not going to test, um, it would basically just shatter. So don't do that. Um, however, um, it, it is what it is. So, I mean, it's to put out light. And, I mean, if you hold your hands close, it puts out heat. I'm not willing to turn the flame up higher. But, I mean, um, it has a purpose. It serves its purpose. So I, I'm going to give it a 4.5. 
And the only reason I'm not giving it a five is just for the simple fact that it's a little on the delicate side. And if I'm honest, I'm a little worried because I'm a klutz. So, um, yeah. Fingers crossed. Always read directions. Hmm. Okay. Yay. Stay safe, stay happy, stay healthy, stay not aflame. And, um, most importantly, stay strange. Good luck.